part 3 SSL certificate how to process the CSR certificate sign in request with CA certificate authority and get the SSL certificate by Sachin Sami powered by itzoz.com this video tutorial is divided into five parts and you are watching part 3 welcome back I am starting this tutorial from where we have left in part 2 this is the CSR text file which we have generated in our previous tutorial. Let's copy this. OK. Right click. Copy. Close the notepad. And open Chrome browser. This is the web page which I have opened in our previous tutorial. In case if you haven't seen our previous tutorial, let me show you once again. First, let's close this browser. OK. Now this is godaddy.com and this is my account that is my name Sachin Sami and this is the SSL certificate credit which we bought from godaddy.com in part 1 of this video. Now let's click on launch. This takes us to a new page. Now we are on certificate manager. I have selected the second option. Now I am going to paste our CSR which we have copied earlier. Okay. As you can see, this is our CSR. The next is Signature Algorithm. From the drop down, we are going to select SHA2. SHA2 features higher level of security than SHA1. It was designed through National Institute of Standards and Technology NIST, and National Security Agency NSA. Next is Certificate Issuing Organization. So let's click on the drop down. Here we have two options. First one is GoDaddy and the second one is Starfield Technologies. So we are going to go with the default that is GoDaddy. Click on the checkbox. I agree the terms and condition of the subscriber agreement. Now let's click next. Now we are on domain validation. It says over here your domain has been validated. Please continue with the confirmation step. This is because the domain itzoz.com is also registered with godaddy.com. If the domain name is registered somewhere else, you will receive a domain verification email. In the email, there will be a link. You have to click on the link to validate the domain name. Now let's click next. Confirmation. Hosting, third party hosting, domain name demo ssl.itzoz.com signature algorithm sha2 certificate signing organization godaddy domain validation method shopper owned now let's click next here it says what now you're through your certificate will be issued shortly you can monitor the progress of your certificate application by going to the pending request folder and clicking on common name. When we are through verifying your application, you will receive an email with further instructions. Now let's click finish. This takes us to pending request page. Here it is showing one request. Now let's click on demo ssl.itzoz.com. Okay, so now we are on the pending request page of demo ssl.itzoz.com. Over here you can see the request details. Status is showing pending. In the request progress section, you can see the current status. Initializing the certificate request is done. Let us click on where it says what is the holdup. Ok. Reviewing domain authorization. Our auto check recognized copyright trademark or publishing related word in distinguished name please allow 2 to 24 hours for us to manually review your domain authorization let's click ok normally the review process can take 1 to 2 hours so what I am going to do is pause this video and resume it once I receive a confirmation email after 2 hours I have received the confirmation email that the SSL certificate has been approved now on the godaddy.com I have logged in with my account. Let's go back to the SSL section. OK. And now I'm going to click on launch. 
in the certificate details section the status is showing current this means the SSL certificate is issued let us click on the download option this brings up the certificate download pop-up important you must follow these steps to ensure the certificate properly secure your site select the server type and download this certificate from the drop-down menu select your server as we are using IIS 8 and the IIS 8 is not available we are going to select IIS 7 ok now click on download the SSL certificate is now downloading it is a very small file let us click on show all downloaded files click on show in folder ok first I am going to minimize the chrome browser as we don't require it anymore now this is the zip file which contains the SSL certificate let's double click on the zip file and check it out what's inside inside the zip file there are two files first one is with .crt extension and the second one is .p7b now let's copy this zip file to the server right click and copy ok open the server remote desktop and paste it over there let us extract the zip file ok now we have two files .crt and .p7b this completes the third part of this tutorial don't forget to watch the next part of this tutorial that will be part 4 how to configure SSL certificate or complete certificate request in IS 8 hello friends thank you for watching our this video tutorial if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe to receive an email update whenever we post a new video share it with your technical IT friends if you are facing any technical problem or have any suggestions post your comment here or catch me on Google Plus, Hangout, Facebook, Twitter and Skype. This video tutorial is presented by Sachin Sami powered by ITZOZ.com and you are watching this on YouTube.